Okay, so this is just a short little video on how to install Minecraft on your Steam Deck. So it'll come up just in the game's library. And you bring on Steam, Minecraft, and you can play it just like this. And you just gotta tap right there. So, what you're first gonna wanna do is go back out and go into the desktop mode. And then, let me just let this update. Okay, so once that finally finishes, shouldn't take you as long but then you want to open up the discover software application and just search for minecraft bedrock and then you should see this one right here, Minecraft Bedrock Launcher. Should look exactly like this. You're gonna wanna install it. And then once that's done installing, I already have it, so I'm not gonna do it again. So once that's done installing, it'll open up and it'll ask you to sign into your Google Play. Now it's gonna use the Android version. So you just gotta sign in and it'll download the latest version automatically. And it should auto update for you. And then the only other thing you have to do is change your resolution to 1280 by 800, because that's the Steam Deck's resolution. So then once that's all set up, just press play and then exit back out. So then the next thing you wanna do is go into Steam, hit add a game, add a non-Steam game, and then you just want to find Minecraft, wherever it is. It should be here on this list, or Minecraft Bedrock Launcher. So then you just want to click the check mark next to it, and it will show up in your library down here. Where is it? So it will show up right here. And then, once you go out, you can launch this from gaming mode. So you want to click return to gaming mode. And the controls won't work when you're in desktop mode. So you have to be in gaming mode for the controls to work. Let's switch over to game mode. And there it is. It's right there. Oops. And now if you have, I forget the name of it. Oops. Now, before I was able to, I think because I don't have Decky in here anymore. Okay, so if you have Decky Loader, you'll be able to change all the icons and everything like how I did. But you don't even need to do that. So now you just can press play right there and you're in. So let's go into a creative world. Bring up the performance tab. Now it does get a little laggy when you have a ton of animals, but other than that, it runs great. Controls great. You could put down, let me just see if I could get it to lag. And then maybe you 
Let's spawn some pigs. And you shouldn't have to change any other settings. So I don't think it dropped any FPS that time. But I bet if I spawn in a million pigs it will. You'll notice if you're playing survival and you have a giant farm that it lags a lot around the farms. But that's only if you have a ton. So yeah, I can't even get it to lag really. And some settings. Just so you can see what I'm playing on. So all of these are turned up all the way. And there we go. The only thing you can't do is enable RTX because you're using the Android version of the game, which it's just not supported. Maybe someday, but that's how you do it. Quick and easy, and it like I said, it should auto update when a new update for Minecraft comes out. But if it doesn't, you just gotta run the installer and click the latest version. That's it. Thanks for watching.